Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today is Christmas Eve um, and I thought I would bring this look for you guys. Um, this is a really beautiful cool toned look. I've already got my foundation on and mis uh, foundation and concealer on um, and we're, we're going to jump straight into the eye. So I'm using the MAC X Aladdin collection. And I'm just going in with um, the darker shadow. So I pointed the wrong one, um, but I'm actually using the one opposite to it. So I will actually insert a photo somewhere. Um, but I'm just using a big fluffy brush to apply that all over my eyelids and um, also in my crease area. Um, I'm just using the windshield wiper motions um, and just blending all of that out. Um, now this eyeshadow brush is a little bit scratchy now because it is really old so then I decided to change the brush and then just kind of give it like a nice smooth finish um, so this is the BH Cosmetics this is my favorite brush I use this for pretty much all my blending for the eyeshadows it is just one of the best soft bristle brushes that I've got in my collection at the moment um, so I'm just building the intensity um, I do go in a couple of times to get to the color payoff that I want it um, and then I'm going in with the Huda Beauty Obsessions palette and I'm using the lighter shadow to sort of um, diffuse that harsh line and also highlight the brow bone. And then I'm going back in with the MAC palette and I'm just using that um, silvery metallic shade. Now with the MAC shadows for like the glitter or the shimmery ones, sometimes they're very powdery, they're very dry. So uh, the brush is not the best formula to blend it out with. I did also experience a lot of fallout with that. So I actually then just went in with the brush and my fingers um, to apply and then also kind of like to get it, give, give it that finished polished look. Um, I went in with the brush. So it was like doing a little bit of both um, to get the right intensity that I wanted. Um, but I've just been incorporating a couple of shadows to kind of get a finished look so you don't really spend too much time just, you know, working on your makeup. You can actually enjoy the festivities and everything like that. So yeah, um, and then I'm just going to intensify the, the outer corner and the crease with that darker shadow from um, the Huda Beauty palette. Um, I went in with this with a denser uh, crease brush and I'm just putting it in, placing it in the outer corner and then just uh, blending it out into the crease. Not putting in too much work, just making just leaving it really, really simple. Um, and then for my eyeliner, I decided to go in with uh, the darkest shadow in the Huda Beauty palette to line my eyes. This is you guys know that it's my favorite way to um, put eyeliner on. Um, and it gives me a lot of control with the, um, it's just an artiste angle brush, gives me a lot of control for the eyeliner. So I love doing that and it's a very soft look. Um, it just, it just elongates and looks really, really pretty and, um, really soft at the same time. Um, I did have a slight wing and I'm after this, I'm just going to go in Actually, I'm going to go in with my face. <laughs> so um, I'm using the Hoola bronzer to bronze up my face, just in my usual places. I thought I would do my brows and foundation, like the base off camera, because it's like the same things I do all the time. And I felt like you guys are probably bored. Um, the videos turned out to be a little bit longer as well. So I figured I would just come on here and do the face products like on top of the base. Um, so yeah, I'm just using the Hoola bronzer using my regular standard BH Cosmetics brushes to apply all of that. Um, I also, I think, yep, I also put that around my nose. Um, and then for my blush, I'm going in with this sleek blush. I leave all the shade names down below, so please be sure to check that out. Just placing that on the apples of my cheeks. And then I'm going to go in with, um, sorry, I'm actually catching a cold at the moment. So I wanted to get this out of the way before I lose my voice as usual. Um, but I'm going to go in and set my face with the Lasting Fix spray. Um, I do a few spritz. This is my favorite setting spray. I cannot even stress on that. And then I'm just going back in with my lid color and placing that on the inner corners of my eyes as well, just to get that pop. I wanted something cool toned and that was the only thing that I had in my collection. So that's what I decided to use. Um, and then I did my mascara off camera and then I'm going in with my lip color. So this is, this was a again one of the cooler toned colors that i had so this is the stila um patina liquid lipstick it's a very matte finished lip um but yeah i hope you guys find this helpful 
Hey guys, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys the finished look. I was actually running a little bit late. I'm already late, so nothing new there. But I thought I would actually show you the makeup in um, daylight um, or natural lighting, sorry. So that's what that's what it's looking like i really love how that's turned out i feel like it looks really really good um it's perfect for like summer uh daytime christmas party um i wanted to do something really casual and natural and i've i love how i've been incorporating just a couple of eyeshadows to get like a finished um look so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video please don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel um and yeah happy holidays you guys i will catch you in the next one bye